at the length of the plane. Find the length defined by x squared to a cos, cos t. Y squared to a sin t. And therefore from 0 to 2 pi. So the formula for arc length of the plane curve is equal to so length is equal to length from a to b square root of dx over dt squared plus dy over dt squared dt so this is the formula to use to solve this one so for this one we are going to differentiate this one and then square when to solve dx over dt of a cos t then you square so for this one so we are going to get a squared A squared then when we get cos t we are going to get negative sin t so that means this one is negative negative a squared sin squared t so you are going to get mm -hmm. so when we come here when they get a sin t when you square after we, we do that one you square after so for this one so I'm going to get a squared cos t squared So we come, we degrade from either from zero to two pi. We substitute this one, this one to this one. So we are going to get a current sense current t. plus a squared cos cos squared t dt remember this negative will disappear because it did we multiply by it by square we square square root we get negative one times negative one you get positive so this one is positive because this one when you integrate this one you integrate this one you get negative a sin t then this one you square so you get something positive you get this one solve for that so for this one after doing this one so we are going to say <coughs> you can factor common terms together so we can say 0 to 2 pi a is common sin square t plus cos square t dt but remember sin scan t plus cos scan t is equal to 1 so this one is equal to 1 a square times 1 is equal to a square so square root of a square to get a so we die negate from that one to we two pi a V dt. So for this one, so we are going to get our answer as two pi a. This is the final answer. Thank you.